Hey guys, I know this isn't the prettiest setup, but hopefully at my bridal shower tomorrow, I'm gonna get curtains and bookends and make this prettier for filming. But um, I want, I thought it would be fun to kind of go over my goals. I mean, go over what happened for 2019 and go over my goals for 2020. I know we're already like into 2020, but it's never too late to go over um, your accomplishments and hardships from the prior year. So if you want to just skip to the doodling part, I'm not gonna do a voiceover for that. You can just skip into the video. But for everyone that stayed, thanks for hanging out. Um, so for 2019, it was kind of a crazy year for me. I got engaged. I, it wasn't that crazy. I mean, I got engaged, which is like amazing. I went to Europe. I mean, that's pretty crazy. I've never been that far out of a country. I live in the USA. So we went to like seven to 10 different countries. We went to Croatia, Montenegro, France, Italy. Um, we got engaged in Tuscany, Italy, which was cool. Um, I went to the Stranger Things house. If you know me personally, you know like I'm obsessed with Stranger Things and I actually watched it on repeat. Like I've seen it at least 20 times, like all the seasons. I actually haven't watched it in like probably like four months because I've just been into other shows. But anywho, so I thought I would tell everyone what I'm planning for 2020 and I have like this huge dream of just selling printable players. Like I wanted to do this years ago and I finally am getting around to doing it. Like I'm starting a blog, a website, like I want to be legit and I have all these ideas and I started it and I have finished January and I made a list of just everything I need to do for January because I'm doing dotted, undotted, dated, undated, and then all of those versions have uh, dotted and undotted, but then all of those versions are also going to have colored like marble, pastels, just witchy um, places where you can doodle yourself so it's like non-color. So that's like my huge dream for 2020. Um, also like this YouTube channel. My main goal when I started was to at least inspire one person to start a bullet journal. So maybe hopefully I've done that. Um, I never really have the goal of being like huge, but obviously I think that's every YouTuber's goal at some point is just making videos and not having to go to like an office job. Although I have an office job and I love my office job, but I am really passionate about bullet journaling and planners and I'm actually really passionate about uh, making my own skincare. I'm really good at making sugar scrubs, body lotion, like legit products, but I don't want to have to deal with cleaning. I hate cleaning the dishes afterwards. And if I were to have that as a business and like sell on Etsy or something, I, I wouldn't be as happy. Like if I made a printable planner, I would make it affordable for everyone. You could print it at home or staples. I don't have to send anything. Um, eventually I would want to sell like a physical planner as well, but right now a printable planner makes the most sense. So yeah, those are my goals for 2020. I thought it'd be fun to just get on camera and be like real, like this is me. I don't know if you can see, I'm in like these slippers that I wear all the time. Um, I have makeup on, which is rare. I had my dress appointment today, which went amazing for my wedding. Um, also, I wanted to touch base on some of the hardships of 2019. I know I'm kind of all over the place. I had no like script for this and I just started talking. So I'm sorry if it's like discombobulated, but back to 2019, I actually got in a car accident on the way home from the gym. I was sitting at a red light and this Domino's driver hit the person behind me who then hit me and then I hit the person in front of me and it involved four cars. It totaled three of the four cars and we were all injured and I actually eventually got a uh, nerve ablation which was killing the nerves in my back which I got I don't know a few months ago and I have just honestly been in like pain which kind of sucks. Um, 
but I'm making the best of it and it'll, it'll be fine. I mean, that was one of my hardships for 2019 and that caused a lot of stress. I had to get a new car and people think that insurance covers a new car, which it covered the value of my old car, but my car was an 05. I couldn't get a reliable car for what they were giving me. Like my car was good, but for five or $4,000, I couldn't get a reliable car. So I had to spend my own money to get a new car, but I am so lucky that I'm able to afford it. And I don't know, I don't know. That's like, that's it. I'm all over the place. And I thought it'd be fun to just kind of let that out because I wanted to like kind of have you guys get to know me. I know I don't have like a huge following, but I know I'm like really good friends with some of you guys. So I thought it would be fun. So anyways, this was the longest video ever intro. I'm sorry. Love you guys. Mwah. Namaste. That was really lame.